Let's see how to create this audio waveform in C Sharp. First we'll need to add a couple of packages to our project. And you can install these by typing in the console .NET add package and audio and .NET add package and audio dot waveform renderer. Then after adding these imports to the top of the file, we can read in our audio file using a new mp3 file reader with the file name. There's also a wave file reader available for wave files. And then it's the most important part, the waveform renderer itself. We can also declare some settings to adjust the width of the image and the height, as defined by the top and bottom peaks. We'll then call render, which will generate the image. If you're building a desktop app, you might want to display this directly in the UI, but for now I'll save it to a file. Let's test it out. And there we are by default, we get this beige color, but let's change it to blue. We can simply set the pens for the top and bottom peak like so, and also set a background color with transparency supported. And now when we run the app again, we get a blue waveform image. Be sure to leave a like if you found this useful, and to keep up to date with all the latest .NET and web dev tips, subscribe to Azul Coding on YouTube.